racked him and he's into 12 late on from 16 to 1. Dane Cottage and North Shadow at 14 to 1 and 18 to 1 and bigger the others. First one's going in. Takajan is one of the first to go forward. Next up is Layla's Lexi. Lord Raglan is about to go forward. Dane Cottage and Rakhtiman are waiting out the back with North Shadow, Brooklyn's Bay, and Ice Viking. So the second half of the field loading up. Rakhtiman and Brooklyn's Bay about to walk in. They go in together. Three more left to load. Dane Cottage is up next. And now the last two, North Shadow and Ice Viking, will complete the line. North Shadow's going in under Franny Norton. North Shadow in, and Ice Viking will be the last for this M&S Travel Money Handicap. That's it. They're all in. They're off with the extended mile and a quarter ahead of them. North Shadow in the noseband was away sharply with Dane Cottage out wide in the green jacket, and they begin to cross over. Lord Raglan also prominent in the black silks, and F of S towards the inside, and it's Lord Raglan through the first furlong who leads from North Shadow pulling hard. Then F of S, Dane Cottage out wide, and behind them, Takajar Noseband takes a bit of a grip from Faith Jacaro, orange jacket up the fence. Back to Rakhtiman in the cheap pieces, who's wide of Brooklyn's Bay. Uh, Layla's Lexi and Ice Viking, the final two, into the turn at the end now of three furlongs. Lord Raglan then leads them along the Viaduct side of the race course. A couple ends up on F of S right down at the fence. North Shadow is obliged to race a little wide Wider, but is prominent. Uh, they in turn attract wider out by Dane Cottage. Then Taka Jan from Faith Jacaro racked him and Brooklyn's Bay is back on the inside of Ice Viking in the pale orange silks. And now a couple lengths to Layla's Lexi. At this stage, he's not uh, traveling with much purpose, it would seem, at the back of the field. And it's just dropped a little off them as they pass through at the halfway point. Lord Raglan then on the sharp end, pursued by FFS Dane Cottage. North Shadow and wider out pulling hard Taka Jan. Back towards the inside, Faith Jacaro from from Rakhtiman, then Brooklyn's Bay. Ice Viking is racing a little wider, and now Layla's Lexi is bustled into it at the back end of the field and races in touch. The field begins to concertina as they head down towards the last three and a half furlongs. Still Lord Raglan, but can't shake off the pursuers. Right at his quarters, green jacket of Dane Cottage. Takajan is wider out. FFS Poise needs a bit of a run. Out wide, Ice Viking is improving stylishly in the headgear. Faith Jacaro is parked on the fence, working back him out as North Shadow falls quickly back through the field, and it's still Lord Raglan inside the two. F of S, Ryan Moore now angling him out. Then Dane Cottage, wider out, Ice Viking. Faith Jacaro in the darker, orange is in the clear. Lord Raglan being gathered in by F of S as they pass the furlong. Ice Viking is chasing, then Faith Jacaro. Lord Raglan game in front. F of S still chasing doggedly. Lord Raglan finding plenty and keeping them at bay. And Lord Raglan makes most, scores readily from F of Ice Viking and Faith Jacaro. First, number four, Lord Raglan. Second, number one. Third, number six. And the fourth placed horse, number five. The full result of our fifth race of the card, the MS Travel Money Handicap Stakes. First, number four, Lord Raglan. Second, number one, FFS. Third, number six, Ice Viking. And the fourth placed horse, number five, Faith Jacaro. The distance is one and a quarter lengths and one and a half lengths. One and a quarter lengths and one and a half lengths. The official time of the winning horse, two minutes, 14.37 seconds. Two minutes, 14.37 seconds.